One of the things that worried Darwin uh, about the theory of evolution was the existence of beauty in, in, in the natural world. Uh, things like the peacock, tail feather, because according to evolution, the, the peacock should be well camouflaged and should be inconspicuous. But the beauty of the peacock tail actually makes it less camouflaged, not more camouflaged. And Darwin realised that was a problem uh, because it was added beauty or beauty for beauty's sake. It's true that uh, beauty is a very subjective uh, thing. We would disagree on how beautiful a flower is. But sometimes beauty is a very objective thing. In the case of the peacock, there are objective mathematical patterns. There's very beautiful deep colours in the peacock feather produced by a special optical effect called thin film interference. And that involves precision design, precision thicknesses of keratin layers. Now, these things don't just happen by chance. You've got to give a reason uh, for these things coming about. There's a, there's a huge amount of genetic information in the peacock to produce the peacock tail feathers. And the, those beautiful tail feathers, they don't help the peacock to fly. They don't keep it warm. So there's got to be a reason for them. Now, because of this problem, he developed what was called the theory of sexual selection. And according to this theory, the female develops preference genes for certain male traits, and the male develops those same traits. And supposedly, the survival advantages uh, for mating outweigh the survival advantages for being camouflaged. If traits are randomly evolved, then there's no reason why they shouldn't be ugly traits or just random patterns. No one has explained why the peacock should be so beautiful, why these random patterns should be beautiful. But then there are other problems. Uh, some of the aesthetic features in the peacock tail are so subtle that the female peahen can't actually see them. So how can she select something that she can't even see? In fact, in a recent study in Japan by Takahashi, published in a, in a journal called Animal Behaviour, uh, it was found that uh, there were no features in the peacock that the, the female peahens had a preference for, and that provides very strong evidence against the theory of sexual selection.